What's up, guys? Thanks for tuning in. If you guys subscribe to me or follow me on Twitter, you would have seen my last video, which is why I'm leaving Ubuntu. And I was basically down to OpenSUSE Leap 15 and Manjaro. So, without further ado, I've made my decision and... Manjaro probably gave it away if you guys have used it before and you saw the little notification icon up here, but you know what? I... A bit of a story, I suppose. Um, the Bumblebee drivers were my issue. I have an NVIDIA card with Optimus and I know not a lot of people have it, so maybe that's why it's not such a big deal. Um, I, I tried for 12 hours, at least minimum, to get this up and running. OpenSUSE itself worked perfect just using my Intel. Maybe if I had a standalone NVIDIA, it would have been great but I followed the instructions on their wiki, which is actually a lot of instructions. And I reinstalled probably six times. This is only part of it, right? This is only for the Bumblebee part, because before you do this, you have to go in here and install the NVIDIA drivers as well. So it's quite a thing. And I, like I said, I reinstalled six times and it just wouldn't work. I. I was troubleshooting. Um, I, I even corrected this in here in their wiki because this showed lib64, which was incorrect. So I actually corrected their wiki even and I just couldn't get it going. I tried using some leap 42.3 packages. I tried using some of their instructions. I, I tried, you know, a lot of things. And finally I was like, you know what? Let me just install Manjaro. And now Manjaro was basically Easy install, I had to of course do the ACPI trick to get it going like I do with pretty much all distros anyways. And if you click, if you're sorry, if you Google Manjaro Bumblebee, uh, the very first link that you get here is their instructions, which are absolutely wonderful. And I literally did this, which was check to make sure you have, you know, the drivers and install the drivers and reboot and then do this to verify that it's working and the hardware is detected and i did that and i was like cool and drivers are installed so i think that's it and sure enough yeah that's it guys that's all i had to do i'm not even kidding so i mean really really easy decision here guys i'm as much as I would love to use OpenSUSE Leap, I love their installer. I love all the things that come with it in their, like their YAST and all the modules in it and everything. Absolutely amazing. But it's really hard to argue when I have an Optimus system, the ease at which I was able to get this up and running. I never even succeeded with OpenSUSE. So I love it. I would like to use it, but this is stopping me and I'm sure it's stopping a lot of people. So I wish they would just get it fixed. That is the wrong command. I just wanted to show you here how the GLX gears runs and I don't have everything set up perfectly. So things are still opening in the wrong screen. So I have to drag things over when they open, but yeah, running now you can see the temperature up and like I said, right out of the box, everything just worked and I was shocked. And to prove, there's a different way I can prove how it's working. You can see the GPU just turned off now. There's another way that I can show that it is working here. So let me just, yeah. All right, so unplug my laptop here. Let me open up another window. So right now, my computer, my laptop, with the second monitor plugged in, the USB microphone and my mouse and everything. For power usage, I'm using a 2100. So I'm running recording software too, don't forget. So with all this running, I'm using 2000, let's see, let's let it settle, 2030, 2020. All right, so 2025, let's call it. All right, and then I'm going to run GLX Gears, which will open in the other window. 
and let it sit. So now this is using the Intel GPU. So 2130, 2085, 2075. All right, so, all right. So that's what I'm using now. And you can still see in the top corner, it says my NVIDIA is off. 2130, 2112. Okay, it all, it all depends on how fast my CPU is running as well, right? So let me exit that and opt to run. So this will use the NVIDIA, which will open again on the other screen. And now you can see 3362 is what I'm using. Huge difference in power, huge. 3340, all right? So obviously you could see by the difference in power consumption that the NVIDIA card is guaranteed turning on and off, which is exactly what I needed. And all I needed to do was type in this, just this and reboot. And that was it. I'm shocked. So yeah, I love you OpenSUSE, but I'm gonna have to go with Manjaro, even though I wanted to stick with Leap because I love fixed releases. I'm not a huge fan of rolling releases. OpenSUSE offers both, Manjaro does not. Uh, I'll put a link to my video. I think I, I have it here somewhere. And it's the difference between rolling releases and fixed releases. I'll put a link up in the top of the screen here. Easy decision for me. Uh, all my Steam games work. I can use Blender and I can use everything for my GPU. And when I'm not using it, it doesn't, doesn't run anymore. It's off. So my battery life is still awesome if I want to use my battery. Laptop runs a lot cooler. So clear, clear, clear winner for me. I wanted to take another second to thank all my subscribers. I'm at 860 now. I do have a giveaway. It's a USB stick. I want USB stick. All right. It is a 32 gigabyte USB 3.0. If I can find a picture of it, it's going to be this little guy here. And it's pretty awesome. I have one. This is gonna be a new one, still in the package. I have it here in my desk. And the awesome thing, guys, is if you're installing a distro, you can pop that into your laptop, pop it into your PC or whatever, and just forget it's there. You don't have to worry about it breaking off, especially if it's in a laptop. You just leave it there. So you have extra storage. You can throw on an extra distro or whatever. And it's not like a, $500 item or whatever, but guys, this is my first giveaway. There will be more, and of course the prizes will get bigger. And so, yeah, happy with that. I have 140 to go, 141 to go until I choose a winner from my subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed already, do that now. And big shout out to my one and only patron, Carl Schneider, who's been a patron of mine for a while. He's an awesome graphics designer. He's done some work for me for Scion and he's done work for Revenge OS and some other stuff. He's got a Google Plus account you can check out. Shout out also to Andreas who does my music in the background. He's an awesome, talented guy. You can check his SoundCloud, which I link to in every one of my videos that play his music. So check the description and go check that out. It's got a wide range of stuff there. Finally, what else? Right, Twitter. You can also follow me over on Twitter at Dorian.slash and find out what's going on. Go to my Patreon page and drop me a few bucks if you're feeling extra generous. Uh, links are all in the description, so go check that out. I'll have another update coming up as well, some extra how-tos and a couple little extra things and what's going on with Manjaro and whatnot. Don't forget to like the video, don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell to get your notifications. And until next time guys, bash on.